think the Clinton brand actually hurt in that, you know, you had Bill Clinton was the signer of NAFTA. You look in this Rust Belt, it was something Donald Trump reminded these voters a lot of. And Hillary Clinton didn't spend a lot of time in, in rural America in particular. So I guess two questions for you. Do you think the Clinton brand itself was maybe too tainted with big donations, big money, NAFTA going back there? And second, do you think Democrats were perceived as looking down on rural America? I tell you whose brand was tainted is Donald Trump. I mean, this guy was tainted every kind of way you could imagine. I mean, no way in the world that Donald Trump is a champion of working people. He has uh, hurt workers in Las Vegas, Atlantic City, Florida, multiple bankruptcies, never showed his taxes. I don't know any good thing this guy has ever done. And yet, because he was able to throw hate and poison on Hillary Clinton, he was able to somehow prevail, uh, uh, in ter at least in terms of the Electoral College. He actually lost the popular right. vote. But, you know, um, I mean, at the, I think he was skilled at just sort of like keeping the attention on anyone but himself. I mean, but this guy is the most outrageous person ever to win a presidential election. So no election. fault. You don't put and this so, fault on Clinton at all? I'm not going to get up here and cast fault on Democrats. I think that, w look, negative campaigning, people do it because sometimes it works. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and then click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.